Um, what's it like to be back? Well, it's 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 goosebumps really. Um, it's been 17 years since uh, that season where where I played and, and managed to score that goal. And I've always wanted to come back. Um, it's certainly been something I wanted to do. And today I've, I've finally done it, and um, it's been great to come back here. Did you obviously at the time when you hit that goal? Did we think about the fact that it's a historic one, the first one here? Um, not at the time. I think um, the whole occasion was, um, you know, it was great for the Reading fans to come to this beautiful stadium. Um, and and really back then it was about just kickstarting our season because we we had played away from home up until then and. And that particular day to get the 3-0 win um, was, was the most important thing, but obviously fantastic to get the goal. Talk us through that goal then. Um, yeah, look, uh, it, was, um, it is etched very well in the memory. Um, there was a corner just on the, the right-hand side and it was thrown over. Not quite sure why I was in the box, to be fair. I'm probably uh, out of position, but uh, it broke to one of our players, laid it off beautifully, and, and it was just an instinct just to smash it as hard as I could. And thankfully for us, it went in the back of the net. I say it was just a single season here. I think ten goals he got during that campaign, but but you know then he were on the road again. Yeah, look, um, I I loved my time here. There's no doubt about it, and um, I had a, a reasonable um, goal scoring record. And um, I, I think over the 48 games or something it was, I, it was a reasonable success. But overriding all that, it was uh, I was still pretty young and, and homesick, and um, you know it, it just didn't work out in the end. But you know, I've only got good things to say about my time at this club and, and being here. And you've certainly sort of flown the nest once more. I know you, you, you never lose your Scottish accent if you're from up in Edinburgh, but uh, you, you're on the side of the world now, right? Yeah, I got the opportunity. I always wanted to play abroad and um, Scottish football was pretty pretty small in terms of who can win things. You know, it was always Celtic Rangers. So to play abroad um, was something that I wanted to do and I got the opportunity and um, I spent six years playing in Melbourne and, and I've settled there now. It's been 10 years, but um, always great to come back to the UK and, and, you know, just coming back to a stadium like this where it's, it's proper, you know, football and, and it's, uh, like I said, goosebumps. And of course, you've you've had to miss the start of the A League today. I think mm. they kicked off this morning, but you've been keeping tabs on the results. Yep, yep. Uh, victory drew nil nil this morning, and I was all over it on the, the streaming on the website. So um, got my fill A League, and uh, I leave next week, and I'll be back for the second game. So, yeah, perfect. Great to speak to you. Thank you so much. Thank you. The next league game saw Luton travel to the magnificent new Majeski Stadium, home of Reading.